for you, no. Most reputable stores won't cash your checks after you're dead. But for Lola, well, girls like that, they're all about the money. Don't you say that. She already saved my life. I was dead in Japan and she brought me back. Everything since then, that's gravy. That's more than I deserve. You owe her everything. So the attempted suicide, the scaring her to death, that's, is that, that's gratitude, love? Yeah, I, I get that. We'll take out what you did to yourself yesterday. We're back to the kidneys and the bones. I'm scheduling the transplant. Never visit a patient. I want that baby. Even if I'm gone, that's a piece of me and Lola breathing, walking around town, going to baseball games. If there's any more transplant talk from you or Lola or anybody else, I, I won't screw it up this time. I'll take myself out for good. I'll start treating the Edisons, which will most likely destroy what's left of your kidneys. Fine. Start the treatment. You're treating him for Addison's and you don't think it's gonna work? He tried to kill himself. I know. He's confused. We can have another baby. I can make him understand that. I'm having an abortion. We do the trans. No. I can make decisions about my body. And he can make decisions about his. He doesn't want your kidney. So, he'll die? Probably. Just being polite. My pants are. Oh, they're all wet. You can't smell that? Ability to smell. I was just in Hank's room. And he said it smelled like the men's room at Veterans Stadium. He was right. We rejected environmental causes because the wife is healthy. Well, she's not. Last six months, she can't smell a thing. Think of them as one single patient. You add her symptoms to his. Got me in poisoning. Explains everything. I mean, why they had so much trouble getting pregnant. How could they have gotten exposed to that much cadmium? Unless they were eating still in batteries for breakfast. So, where else is cadmium? Some foods, polluted groundwater. We should check their home. I think I know how it happened. I'm gonna need another urine sample. What for? Sure. Whatever you want. Why wouldn't you give it to me before, but now it's no problem? I'm dying, right? So you've got nothing to lose this time. Begs the question, what were you worried about last time? The funny thing is, when we tested you before, we were just looking for steroids. What should we look for now, Hank? Hank? What's the story? A little weed every now and then when no one was looking? I don't believe this. We quit. You did. If you kept going, you wouldn't have just lost your sense of smell. I quit the hard stuff. I just needed to relax. Based on the symptoms, you're a lot more than a social user. So you've been lying to me all this time. I'm sorry. There must have been cadmium in the soil where the marijuana was grown. Some people get bone loss, kidney failure, some people's testes shrink, and some people lose their sense of smell. We'll start treatment right away. You should be fine by opening day. Baseball's in the summer, right? It didn't hurt the baby, did it? The cadmium? If you've been clean, the baby should be fine. Okay. Please. I'll stop everything. I'll, I'll go to meetings every day.
How's the ball player doing? Much better. Too bad about his career. What do you mean? Major League Baseball's collective bargaining agreement requires medical reports on all treatment. Given Hank's history, he's not likely to get much leniency. Well, why should they care that he's being treated for Addison's? You're not treating him for Addison's. My report says I am. You're lying on the report? Everybody does stupid things. It shouldn't cost them everything they want in life. No, it shouldn't, but it usually does. On the other hand, if it means someone can actually beat the Yankees, 